Okay, hello everyone. Sa isa na naman pong MTOF reviewer, which is ang mga questions po dito is from 2019 MTOF Dev Ed Math Challenge. Um, elimination round 4, elementary. So, ang mga questions po is involve yung mga percentage problem and fraction problem. So, complete solution and explanation. Okay, bago po ako mag-start, gusto ko muna magpasalamat sa mga sumusuporta. Thank you very much po. Um, thank you very much sa pagbabalik sa channel ko and pagla-like ko. Thank you so much. Okay, eto na. Let's start with one, number 1. What is the value of 3 over 4 plus 5 over 2 times 3 over 4? So, the solution is, ia-apply natin ang MDAS rule. So, maunang multiplication, division, addition, and bago yung subtraction. So, let's start with the multiplication. I-times muna natin yung 5 over 2 and 3 over 4. So, pag nagta-times tayo ng fraction, um, tina-times natin or minumultiply natin yung numerator sa numerator, denominator sa denominator. So, 5 times 3 is, if, is equal to 15. 2 times 4 is 8. Okay, and then saka natin balikan yung iniwan natin 3 over 4. I-add natin siya dun sa result ng product ng 5 over 2 and 3 over 4. So, 3 over 4 plus 15 over 8. <clears throat> so, ang LCD is 8. So, 8 divided by 4 is 2 times the numerator 3 plus 8 divided by 8 is 1 times 15. We have 15. And then 2 times 3 is 6 plus 15. So, 6 plus 15 equals 21 over 8. So, the answer is 21 over 8. Okay, number 2. What is the sum of all odd numbers greater than 1 and smaller than 21? So, pag sinabi nating odd numbers, those are 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, 11, 13, 15, 17, 19, and so on. Um, kaya lang sa condition dito, it is greater than 1 and is smaller than 21. Okay, so these are the following. 3, 5, 7, 9, 11, 13, 15, 17, and 19. Uh, we're going to find the sum. Since meron siyang pattern, okay, so ang gagawin natin dito para mas madaling mag-solve ipa-plus natin yung bawat dulo. Ayan, 3 plus 19 is 22. 5 plus 17 is 22. 7 plus 15, 22. 9 plus 13 is 22. So, the answer is 88. Okay, and then, um, may natitira pang isang even number which is 11. So, ang gagawin natin, i-add natin. Yung 88 plus 11 equals 99. So, the sum of all odd numbers greater than 1 and smaller than 21 is 99. Okay, number 3. If A is equal to 2 and B is equal to 3, then, 1 over A plus 1 over B equals. And, so this is the solution. We substitute the value of A and B, which is A is 2, B is 3. Okay, so magiging 1 over 2 plus 1 over 3. So, get the LCD, which is 6. 6 divided by 2 is 3. 3 times 1 is equal to 3. And then, 6 divided by 3 is 2 times 1 equals 2. Then, 3 plus 2 equals 5 over 6. So, the answer is 5 over 6. Okay, number 4. In a class of 30 students, 40% wear glasses. 3 of those wearing glasses are left-handed. Of those wearing glasses, what glasses, what percent are left-handed? Okay, so ang solution muna natin dito, i-convert natin yung percent to decimal. So, 40% it is equal to 0 0.40. So, ita times natin yung 30 sa 0.40 is equal to 12. So, ibig sabihin, 12 ang nag-wear ng glasses. Okay, and then dun sa problem, 3 of those wearing glasses are left-handed. So, para makuha natin yung percentage ng left-handed sa wearing glasses, um, i-divide natin yung 3 over 12 and then lowest term natin simplify so that is 1 over 4 or um, in percentage we have 1 divided by 4 is equal to 0 0.25 or 25% ok 
Okay, number five. The selling price of a coat, which normally sells $55, was reduced by 20% during the spring sale. Since the coat still didn't sell, the sale price was reduced by 10%. So, what is the total reduction from the original selling price? So, tinatanong dito kung magkano yung total na uh, reduction nung um, coat na yun, which is ibabawas na natin doon yung 20% at saka 10%. Okay, so this is the solution. Iko-convert muna natin yung 20% sa decimal at 10% sa decimal. 20% is equivalent to 0.20 and 10% equals 0.10. So, unang gagawin natin is i-reduce muna natin yung $55 um, dollars sa 20%. Okay, 20% ng $55 dollars is $11 dollars. So, ang ginama ko din, uh, $55 dollars times um 0.20 equals $11. Yun yung 20% ng 55. And then, may minus ko yung $55 sa $11. Uh, $55 minus $11 para makuha ko kung magkano na yung current price. And then, dahil babawasan pa ulit natin ng 10%, $44 i-multiply natin sa 0.10. So, the answer is uh, 4.40 yun yung 10% ng $44. So, ang gagawin natin, i-add natin yung dalawang dinidak natin na percentage or na percent, which is $11 and $4.40. And the answer is $15.40. Yan yung total reduction from the original selling price. Okay, thanks. For watching, that's all for now, guys. And thank you for, uh, for the support. And so please don't forget to click the like, subscribe, and the bell button below for more videos. You can also visit my YouTube channel, Mat Each, for my complete uploads. Thank you.